Dead by Daylight just released a new tome with a new type of glyph on it, the green glyph. I have seen some misconceptions about how they work, so I hope this quick guide will make it easier to understand. Selecting this challenge will spawn many green glyphs around the map at the start of your match. Now from my experience, this many glyphs it seems like it only spawns 2 per person that has the challenge active. The glyph will spawn in spots where totems could spawn, not where totems are. So to all you booners who have memorized totem spawns, just look around the map for these spots and you will find the glyphs. When you are 8 meters close from them, you will hear this distinct sound effect. All you have to do is simply interact with them. Now this can be done either as a survivor or as a killer, just in case you didn't know. Tired of tunneling and camping? Play a round of killer to get two green glyphs. Now what about the in-game collapse part? Well, if you have trouble finding the glyphs, worry not. The moment the in-game collapse starts, you will see the aura of the glyphs all around the map, so you can go and interact with them. It takes two seconds to interact with them as a killer. It takes eight seconds as a survivor, so be careful you can be grabbed from it. The later in the season we get, more people will have the challenge active. This means more people will have green glyphs spawned. You can interact with the two glyphs that another survivor or killer have, so don't worry. I hope this clears any misunderstandings. Thank you for watching, and if this was useful, consider dropping a like, it helps me a lot. Also, check my other glyph guide if you need any help with any of the other glyphs. Have fun in the fog.